Now at 60. A hard luck playhouse reborn better than ever. Still ahead, the Westchester Theater able to celebrate 75 years thanks to a big name in music. And it's now much more than just a place to go catch a good show. Well, in Westchester, it's the little playhouse that could, and it's now doing so much more. You may not have heard of it, but the Bedford Playhouse is a little gem known to more than a few celebrities. And after a rough patch of closure and COVID, it is back, celebrating 75 years of bringing movies and plays to families. News for Zinda Baccaro shows us why the Playhouse almost didn't make it and why it's now so much more than just a theater. At the Bedford Playhouse, the show must go on. The independent theater in Westchester County poised to celebrate 75 years with its share of highs and lows. Michael Hoagland is executive director. April 30th, 1947, uh, Bedford Playhouse officially opened with Boomerang. The Playhouse in the heart of Bedford Village first opened in 1947. But after more than six decades, the silver screen tarnished. The Playhouse shut down in 2014. In the cinema industry at that time, things were starting to shift to either the very, very big players in the, in the industry or uh, independent cinemas that were more art house based. Within a year of shutting down, cue local theater lovers to the rescue, a grassroots effort to reopen the playhouse involving some familiar names. Some pretty powerful players came along with them. Uh, Clive Davis, of course, uh, who is our, our namesake, and uh, Chevy Chase was along for the ride, uh, Glenn Close, um, Paul Schaefer. After raising six and a half million dollars, this time lapse shows the rebirth of a new Bedford Playhouse with a 40 foot screen and top notch sound system thanks to record executive legend Clive Davis. This time it's a nonprofit center focused at becoming a meeting spot for the community. In addition to showing feature films, there's a cafe and bar and flex space for speaking events. But the rebirth with much fanfare happened just before the pandemic. Tough times ahead again. So the Playhouse found new ways to engage the community. We have a mental health series. We have uh, an environmental series. Now the Bedford Playhouse is proud to present its 75th anniversary with three big events this week, including a French themed screening of An American in Paris. We're looking forward to not only uh, celebrating the last 75 years, but looking forward to the next 75 years. In Bedford, Linda Beccaro, News 4, New York.